Welcome to Endoscopy Campus EndoClub Nord 2020 video series. In the following, you will see Guido Schachschall performing a Zenker's poem procedure in a combination of septotomy and tunnel myotomy. This is a uh, 70 two-year-old patient with uh, on the left side the diverticulum until the ground with an estimated diverticulum size of uh, about uh, two centimeters and on the right side the entry into the esophagus this is the esophageal lumen and the plan is to place a gastric tube into the esophagus to help with orientation during treatment and protect the contralateral mucosa. So this is the tube which has to be redirected. And finally enters the esophagus usually ends up in the diverticulum but can be redirected with the help of the endoscope. As you can see here the endoscope pushes the tube aside and here the tube is coming and getting into the right direction in the esophagus. Here you see the uh, septum on the left side. We will be using a conical cap and this is the septum we also using the new Olympus 1500 gastroscope. Treatment starts with a minor injection into the septum with a special needle here. Just a minimal amount of uh, bluish uh, saline, which uh, should be enough. And then we uh, continue with the knife, which is uh, the dual knife by Olympus. which also allows for simultaneous injection. A transverse section over the septum is planned. In contrast to a longitudinal injection chosen by some others. So you cautiously start injecting the upper end of the septum and try to make the opening large enough to get into this small tunnel with the endoscope. Careful dissection and here injection into the submucosa of the esophageal site. And uh, here we have the perspective, the anatomy, the gastric tube on the right side and a direct view onto the muscular septum. This is a rather broad muscularis of the cricopharyngeal muscle. Uh, the inferior constrictor muscle. The depth of uh, myotomy has not fully elucidated. We uh, again inject uh, to isolate uh, the muscular layer. 
and uh, with a special current called Twin Coac by Erbe, we continue to dissect. <coughs> it's not fully clarified how far we should go. We continue injection and we assume that there is an underlying motility disorder which leads to the diverticulum. Costamania showed that dissections less than two centimeters lead to increased recurrence. The uh, mucosal flap here of the septum is also dissected and uh, at the end the diverticulum is closed by clips as you can see here and the clipping is extended this is uh, the uh, remaining pocket and uh, to avoid pocket creation the entire opening has to be closed we use various clips uh, depending on the situation various sizes uh, and specifications and here the clip is placed over the opening and closed and manipulated uh, and then finally fired and here we have uh, the final clips to fully close the opening the instrument has to be manipulated to see whether we can fire yes we can and uh, finally we do a check into the esophageal lumen as you can see here which ends the procedure immediate follow-up shows some color emphysema which was resolving and the patient's condition improved.